Okay, so in this example here, we have a used car dealer who puts his cars through a two-stage process to get them ready to sell. The mechanical checkup costs six, $50 per hour, and it follows a normal distribution. It takes an average of 90 minutes, standard deviation of 15 minutes. The appearance, though, costs $6 an hour, and the time is also normally distributed. It takes an average of 60 minutes with a standard deviation of 5, and it says be careful of the units. And so the first thing we want to do is find the mean and variance of the total, the total expense of the car prep. So, well, let's first define what we have. We know that M is normally distributed 90 minutes, but it says be careful of the units. This is minutes, that's hours. So let's say it's 1.5 hours. And the standard deviation is 20, 15 minutes, which is uh, 0 0.25 hours in square to make it variance. Similarly, my appearance will be 60 minutes, which is one hour, and five minutes, which is five out of one out of 12 squared is the variance, okay? So those are defined. You should pause the video and try this example yourself. But I wanna find the total expense. So the total expense, T. Well, T is going to equal $50 times the mechanical, so 50M plus $6 for A. Oh. So it's 50M, I can't forget the M, plus $6 for A. And so A and M are normal, so I also know that T is also going to be normal. And its expected value is going to be, if I do expectation algebra on here, I know the expected value of 50m plus 6a is simply going to be 50 times the expected value of m plus 6 times the expected value of a. Well, it's 50 times 1.5 plus 6 times 1. The 50 times 1.5 mm -hmm. is 75 plus 6 is, it should be $81 is my expected value. So $81. The variance of 50M plus 6A, well, when I do algebra on this, I end up with 50 squared times the variance of m plus 6 squared times the variance of a. And when I crunch that, I get a value of 156.5, and that is the variance. So I get 156.5. And so the total expense is normally distributed expected cost of 81 and the variance is 156.5. Now, B part says, what is the probability it will take longer to do the appearance prep than the mechanical checkup? Well, if I think about what it's saying, I'm not looking at the cost anymore. I'm just looking at the appearance being more than the mechanical. So if the appearance is gonna be more than the mechanical, that means I want the appearance to be greater than the mechanical. I find this probability. Well, if I'm gonna do that, well, I can make a new expectation variable, or random variable, sorry, of A minus M, and I want that bigger than zero. But here's my new random variable. So A minus M, if I want the expected value, well, it's gonna be one minus 1.5, and it's going to be normal, so I'll make it normal. It's going to be negative 0 0.5. It's going to be normal because A and M are both normal. My variance, though, so if I want to do my variance of A minus M, I have to be careful here. I know it's going to be the variance of A plus, be careful here, it is plus because the variation is getting larger when I combine variables. And so it's going to be 0 0.25 squared plus 
1 12 squared. And when I do that, I know that that has a variance of 5 out of 72. So it is definable as such. A minus n is normal with a mean of this, a variance of that. And I want to actually find the probability now that a minus m is bigger than 0. Well, if I think about my normal curve, this is negative 0 0.5. Here's 0. I'm looking for this area here. So I go to my calculator and I go second distributions, normal CDF. My lower is 0. My upper is a big number. This is negative 0.5. This is going to be 5 divided by 72 squared. Oh, uh, this is variance. I need to make this square root. So I'm going to be careful here. I want to go square root of 5 divided 72. And that mistake I almost made is a very, very common mistake. So make sure you keep thinking about it. I got standard deviation or variance. And when I do this calculation, I end up with the probability being 0.0289. So 3% chance that the appearance takes longer than the mechanical.